Hey everyone, Games Apprentice back with another Steam Deck tutorial and this week I'm going to be showing you how to install the EA app on your Steam Deck. Now first of all, let me get the prereqs out of the way. You need to have Proton installed and you need to have a web browser installed. These are both really easy to install via the Discover Store, but if you don't know how to do this, you can check out the video above. The first couple of steps in there should tell you everything you need to know and then join me back here. If you're already a subscriber to my channel, you've probably already got this installed and you're probably going to find this process very familiar to install the EA app. If you're not a subscriber, hopefully you will be by the end of the video. The first step is to download the EA installer. To do this, you're going to first need to head into desktop mode. Once in desktop mode, open up a web browser and head to this web page. Or if you're lazy, just type EA and it's probably going to be the first result. Click on the download button to download the app. There are two ways you can add this app into Steam. If you're in the downloads directory already, you can just right click it and add to Steam. Or alternatively, open up Steam and click on add new game and non Steam game. Both those methods should bring you to this same selection. Click on browse. Find the directory where you downloaded the EA installer. Probably just downloads if you haven't changed it. If it's not showing up, just delete everything from the filter. Click on the EA app installer and then click open. Head into Steam and find the newly added EA app installer. Click on the cog icon and go to properties. Under compatibility, change the Proton version to Proton Experimental, then close the window. Hit play and wait for the EA app to install. Once it's done, you'll either get a blank blue box or a login screen. Either way, click the cross and click stop in Steam. So we've installed the EA app, but now we need to add that app to Steam so we can run it through Proton. To find it, head to the following location. You may need to show hidden files first by right-clicking and selecting that option. Once there, this will bring you to a bunch of folders with numbers, or just one if this is the first thing that you've installed. If you've got multiple, right-click and sort by date with newest first, and then head into the first folder. If you don't select newest first, it'll be the last folder. Then go to this location. Locate the EA desktop.exe file within this folder. Right click it and copy location. Next, head to Steam. Find that EA installer app and go to the properties section again. Very carefully highlight everything inside the quotes in the target field, but not the quotes at the start or at the end. Right click and paste. Then highlight everything in the start in field and paste. Then remove EA desktop.exe from the end of the start in field. Once done, just rename the shortcut something if you want, exit, and then hit play. This should bring up the login field, login, and then you're ready to go. If you want to spruce it up a bit with EA logos and whatnot, you can check out my video on how to do that. Like anything with a Steam Deck, expect varying success from game to game. I had to play Mirror's Edge with all the tutorials in Bulgarian. I don't speak Bulgarian. Still playable though. As always, thanks so much for watching. I hope this video has been helpful and if it has, let me know in the comments and also any problems that you've encountered and I'll try my best to help. Don't forget to subscribe for more of my content and hopefully I'll catch you next time.